Hey YouTube, this is FireWizard23, and welcome back to Let's Play Mylon's Secret Castle. Okay, so we just finished up in this room here. Uh, let's do some exploring. Uh, let's go this way. Oh! Uh, this is where that little shop was. A water pot in the icy room. Okay. Don't forget that. What's in... Uh, isn't this where you... I think it's, no, it's over there we popped out. What's in here? Oh, yeah, it doesn't go anywhere. Let's go in here. Oh, that's the room I don't want to be in yet. I don't want to be in this room. Well, I got the key already. Let's just get out of here. Shrink! Shrink, damn you! I don't want to... No. There's something I could do here if I wanted. There, there, is, there is one thing I could do. But I was r really feeling adventurous. Oh, money. Grab the cash. What's in here? Is this the exit? Oh, there is this thing. Let's grab it. Glide down slowly. I can now hold up an A and I fall down very slowly. A crown and a cane is needed at the fourth floor. That's important. Ooh, more money. Ah, thank goodness for regenerating items. Oh, I'm sorry, sorry, just hold A. Just hold A and you just float. Let's get out of here. So what door is it? This one? No, it's not that door. We'll figure this out. As you, as you notice, I'm a little, a little confused on method here. See if we can just hold A and we glide down slowly. Even out here we can do that. So that's going to actually be pretty useful. In fact... Oh, I can't use it to get out. Oh, yeah, we can use it to get up here. Let's go! Aha! The treasure room! As uh, Draggy Duck was telling me. Get in the treasure room and do go this way. Oh, we got super shoes. We can jump really high with those. But I don't have 60 bucks. Yet. Well, let's head back up there. Do, do. So we go back in here. Ha ha! Broken game mechanics for the win! I think we can get to regenerate one more time, and then we'll be able to grab that those goodies. Hey, go, go, go! <laughs> yes! We now have the money we need. Jump high anywhere. I don't have the high jump. It doesn't seem like it, but we are jumping higher. I'll, I'll demonstrate it in the Demon Monster Room. Watch. Whoa! That's Game Genie broken right there. And remember, we can jump and float. So that's going to give us a really big advantage now. Where do I want to go? It's not the towers. Go here? No, is it... I don't think I can go in there yet. Okay, I'm going to do a save state, because I, I feel like this is not the room I want. Oh, this is the room. Oh, I've been Here it is. This is what I wanted. Okay. Uh, welcome to this room. <laughs> I found it. Oh. Okay, the first order of business is see if we can find the music box. And I happen to know just where the music box is. Because I'm smart. Where's the exit door? If, if you were wondering, let's get small here. That's going to make maneuvering around this room just a little bit easier. The magic key has appeared somewhere. Wish I had double bubble power. Ooh, 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 ooh. I see that platform by there, right there? We cannot see that without that thing that lets us see invisible objects, nor can we land on it without the feather. That makes us lighter. So you can ride the elevators. And that door is actually really important, that one that's kind of hovering in midair. We're going to want that door because there is 
definitely in there we definitely need. Pretty much all the items in this game are useful. Gotcha. I'm pretty sure I knew where the box was. Could Far was a 23 be wrong? No, of course not. Oh, there it is, yep. I know it's around here somewhere. Let's grab the box. Get some more money. We got a trumpet in the mix. It's a trumpet. Oh, hell yeah. It's a trumpet. It's a trumpet. Almost got all the instruments in the band. No, we did come in here small. Now the melody is starting to sound much better with all the instruments involved. Oh, I remembered something I wanted to talk about. I forgot to talk about this on the other video. Okay, so I live in a town where apparently there was a battle. And it is the, you know, the battle of this town. It was like a civil, it was a, um, a revolutionary battle that happened in this town, like, way long ago. Alright? So, I'm looking at the... There's a... Hey! <coughs> Good night. I was at a, um, like a little art display from, like, the elementary school, and, like, they're doing, like, pictures of, like, the battle and stuff, and it's got, like, all the soldiers lined up, and here's ships and stuff, and, you know, this battle's gonna go down and all that. I'm thinking, where are all the dead people? You know, I mean, I'm not trying to be mean here, like, I'm encouraging, like, death and stuff, but, like, people did, do, like, die in war, don't they? So, like, where, where are all the pictures of the kids drawing, like, all the mutilated bodies and stuff? <laughs> I... I understand that's not something you want kids to do, but it is kind of just a weird thing in our culture. Like, we don't... Eek. No! I wanted the umbrella! No! Oh! Check it out. A key. Like, why don't we... You know, we really kind of gloss over... Our culture is very romanticized about what we talk about and what we don't. <laughs> Like, yeah, because yeah, Disney was kind of guilty of this, too, that, like, they would do, like, for example, Johnny Appleseed, if anyone's ever seen that, that cartoon, there literally is a dance sequence in that of the uh, Native Americans dancing happily with the white man, and it's like, okay, y you realize that, like, it wasn't always lollipops and gumdrops, right? Like, you know, th they're actually really kind of pissed that we just came over and basically just took all of their land, you realize? <laughs> Just saying. <laughs> it, 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 it's just a really fun irony to me. And I do want $50. That's really important. And I may have to come back to do this. Now, as you notice, there's a huge thing here I'm digging out. But why am I digging it out? Well, you think there's something here? And truth, we're going to get a lot of money from all this, definitely. Because you see we found a couple of dollars there. And there's a couple of bricks we can't break here and there just so we can climb back out. Oh, ooh, 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 honeycomb. Ah, uh, as you notice, the honeycomb does also refill our life as well as giving us one extra energy bar. So that makes it awesome, because everything is awesome. No. Yes, yeah, so I just, I want to do like this punked prank where I'm just walking over... Very calmly to all these art pictures and stuff, and I'm, I'm just, like, acting like I'm a principal or, or a teacher of the school. And I just put up all these, like, artsy kid pictures of, like, people being mutilated and stuff. Like, people being shot and just uh, lying down on the ground in blood and stuff. And I just imagine, like, these horrified people looking at, like, what are you doing? Like, these can't be kids' pictures. Like, yeah. What do you want from me? That's what actually happens in war. Did you know that? Like, like people, like, die. <laughs> I'm sorry, I believe, I believe in teaching kids the harsh, cruel reality of life. I don't, I don't, I don't butter up this shit. <laughs> oh no, the only way to get on is ride the platform. It's on the gate space. Oh, I want triple bubble power. I got triple bubble power. Can I catch up with the platform? Huh? Yes, okay. See, there's the sword for 50 bucks. That makes my bubbles even more powerful. Watch out for a phony princess. That's actually really important. That's a subtle uh, warning about something that's going to happen later in the game. 
And let's get out of here, because unfortunately we don't have the money. So we're going to have to go somewhere where we can make some money. And I do know at least one place we can make money, and that is in this room that I've been saying, like, oh, I don't want to go here yet, I don't want to go here. We guys go. Guess what? We're going here now. But I still can't do it yet. At least if I remember my order in the game, that we really cannot complete this room yet. I don't think we're supposed to. But uh, the most important reason is there is the money right here. And just for giggles, there's the final music box. Uh, notice we have the final instrument, the violin. And this is the last of these rooms. Got to grab all the nerds. Got to make some awesome music. Oh, yeah. Yes, come on. Yes, I did. This is kind of my commentary on that. It's like, where's all the dead people, you know? <laughs> Forty-eight notes. Not a huge haul. Well, let's get the door out of here and let's go get that sword. Because we do need that sword. That is very, very critical. Let's shrink for some reason. Oh, no, it's up. It's up, 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 up. Oh, ooh, more money. Regenerating money. I know people thinking, like, why don't you just go back to that thing that had the 15 gems? I, I think it only revives a certain number of times. I, th I think it's three. Okay, let's go get that sword. <clears throat> Grab it! Power up the bubble. Now, there's only one item left in the whole game, but now if we look at our bowls... Aha! This bubble is not powerful enough to damage certain types of enemies. Or to the point that it can actually damage certain types of enemies. That's going to be real important. Because there's certain types of enemies, well, we can't damage with regular bubbles. Regardless of how big we make them. Let's get out of here. Okay, so we now have the bubbles. So what do we do now? Well, uh, the game now proceeds that we have to fight a certain, the remaining demon monsters that exist. And our first uh, location to do that is actually the left tower. So next time, oh, by the way, our bubbles can now actually damage the lightning. So next time, um, let's play Mylon Secret Castle. We're going to head in the left tower. This is Firewizard23. Take care and bye-bye for now, everybody.